بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس آور کرنٹ سیشن فوکسز آن دا پیڈوگوجیکل پرنسپل آف دا سوشو کاگنیٹو اپروچ ٹو اکیڈیمک رائٹنگ آئی ہوپ اینڈ ایکسپیکٹ بائی دا اینڈ آف دس سیشن یو وڈ ہیو سم آئیڈیا آف اینڈ سم انڈرسٹینڈنگ آف دا سوشو کاگنیٹو اپروچ اینڈ دا پیڈوگوجیکل پرنسپل دیٹ آپریٹ بہائنڈ اٹ وین اٹ کمس ٹو اکیڈیمک رائٹنگ ویل مائی ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹریڈیشنل اپروچز ٹو ٹیچنگ ایل ٹو رائٹنگ ہیو Um, a certain perspective which includes the controlled composition approach, the, the rhetorical function approach, the process approach and fourthly the genre approach. All these approaches are comparatively more conservative and traditional approaches towards the teaching of writing in L2. Traditional approaches have their own strengths but may not be sufficiently effective as writing pedagogy especially in the Uh, context of today's world teaching students the rhetorical moves and organization structure as well as helping the students um, in generating certain ideas and planning in is very important and necessary but this is not the only thing that is required so this is not sufficient when it uh, comes to teaching and learning writing in um, an l2 classroom now what is the reason these devices alone do not consider reader uh, expectations socio cultural factors and key thinking processes that are involved in the process of writing well when it comes to the socio cognitive approach towards uh, the pedagogical uh, underpinnings uh, providing uh, certain pedagogical underpinnings for academic writing well uh, it is comparatively a recent approach it is newer and a comparatively a strategic approach to the teaching of writing in an l2 classroom it highlights the importance of explaining the purpose of writing to the students because in terms of social impact when they understand what is the purpose for which they are writing um it makes their writing more meaningful for them and it it improves their writing students writing not only um takes place because they are told to write but they write in order to fulfill some social function or to perform some social function through their writing for example the function for writing a story is to entertain the readers or to make the readers admire the characters of that story knowledge transmission uh, or transformation is another important implementation device in the socio cognitive approach towards writing when students plan organize write and revise actually they need to ensure that the relevant information um helps them achieve the macro rhetoric uh, goal of the writing so you know bringing um, the all the aspects of the of the piece of writing for example a narrative a story or an essay together to create a macro level or an overall level um impact to achieve the macro goal this is what the students uh, in um this uh, socio cognitive approach try to achieve through the processes not only of organizing and writing but also through revising their work by adopting the socio cognitive approach to writing students consciously define their goal as an impact on the intended reader so the consciousness or the awareness of what is the impact that they want to create through this writing this enables them to uh, write in a better and more efficient way writing teachers should emphasize to the students that a good piece of writing cannot be produced in one draft there are needs for revisions and re-revisions it is also very important for students uh, to adopt the technique of self uh, editing um they need to learn self editing strategies because uh, by revisiting reassessing and reevaluating their own uh, piece of writing they can improve it a lot giving peer feedback is also considered to be very good in the process of uh, uh, writing according to the socio cognitive approach towards writing it is not only considered to, to be good uh, you know in terms of the improvement of writing but also those who give this feedback that is the other peers uh, who provide uh, feedback to um, one of the co learners in the classroom this enables them to think critically and thus um thus develops the the critical thinking skills uh, of the peers as well